Hello everyone. Uh, today we have a new grammar lesson. Types of sentences. We have statements, questions, commands, and exclamations. So let's start. So the first type is statements. A statement is a sentence that gives information. It tells you something. You would understand a thing when you read it. It ends with a period, a full stop, and a statement consists of a subject, a verb, and maybe an object. Look at the examples. History is my favorite subject. This is a statement. Why? Because it gives you information, it tells you something, and it ends with a full stop. Right? It also has a subject and a verb. So history is my favorite subject. This is a statement. The government will make an announcement soon. This is also a statement. It gives you information, it tells you something, and it ends with a full stop. We have also Karen reads two newspapers every day. So this is also a statement because it also gives you information, it tells you something, it has a full stop, and so on. And then we have questions. A question is a sentence that asks something, asks you about something, and it also has a question mark at the end of it. So, a question ends with a question mark. Look at the examples. Can you speak Russian? Here, I'm asking, can you speak Russian? This is why I need to add a question mark at the end. What did you have for breakfast? This is also a question. What did you have for breakfast? We have the question word what and we have a question mark. So what did you have for breakfast? I'm asking you about something. And do you like watching movies? Here I'm also asking you a question. Do you like watching movies? So I need to add a question mark at the end. The third type, commands. A command is a sentence that tells some, someone to do something. It gives you an order, do something. It ends with a period and it lacks a subject. You will not find a subject in the command sentence. Look at the examples. Eat your dinner. Eat your dinner. This is a command because it tells someone to do something. It is an order and it ends with a full stop and it doesn't have a subject. The first word is a verb. Eat your dinner. Then we have be quiet. Here I am telling someone to do something. Be quiet. It's an order. Be quiet. And it doesn't have a subject and we need to add a full stop at the end. Open the door please. Open the door please. So this is also a command. It starts with a verb. It doesn't have a subject and it tells someone to do something. So we need to add a full stop at the end. Alright, so the last type that we have is exclamations. An exclamation is a sentence that shows strong feeling or strong emotion. It ends with an exclamation mark and it can usually start with the words how and what. And be careful, it's not a question. You will not see that it's asking about something by using how or what. Let's look at the examples. The first one. How clever you are. How clever you are. This is an exclamation sentence. It ends with an exclamation mark. It shows strong feeling. I'm very surprised of how clever the person is. So how clever you are. I'm showing my emotions or my feelings. And it started with the word how, but it's not asking a question. It's not asking about something. What a beautiful day. What a beautiful day. So here, this is an exclamation sentence. It also shows strong feelings or my emotion about the day, how beautiful or what a beautiful day it is. All right. And it ends with an exclamation mark. The last one, our team won the championship. Our team won the championship. Here I am showing my excitement by using the exclamation mark. 
our team won the championship i'm very excited i'm very happy so here i'm showing my emotions and my feelings by adding the exclamation mark so as we said we have four types of sentences we have statements commands questions and exclamations statements and commands both of them end with a period a full stop questions end with a question mark exclamations end with an exclamation mark so this is simply our grammar lesson i hope you enjoyed it bye